adjust the settings on your new line display, you'll start by going to the settings configuration page. To get there, you can select on an individual device or you can select on multiple devices. Once you've selected your devices, select actions and settings. Here we are on the settings configuration page. To create a new settings configuration, select add new. You'll want to label your settings. Once you've created a label, you'll scroll down on the left side until you see the word new line. This is going to be your new line specific settings. To turn on these settings, on the right side, you'll see these multiple gray buttons. If you toggle to the right, the button will turn green. That means the setting is on. If you toggle to the left, you'll see that it turns red. That means that setting is off. If it is gray, that means it is neutral, is not on or off. Now, some of the settings you can adjust on your panel. You can turn on and off eye protection writing. You can enable the panels to turn on and off at a certain time of the day. You can enable wake on LAN, eye protection brightness. You can have the panel to automatically switch to a new source when it is plugged in. You can turn on and off your left and right side toolbar. You can turn on the eye protection blue light filter and also adjust that level. You can select a favorite source. You can also clear whiteboard files after a certain amount of time. You can also enable and disable the CEC auto power on and off. And lastly, you can adjust the energy saving mode on all of your new line displays. Once you have created the settings that you would like on your displays, you'll select confirm. Once you have set that, you will select on your settings and select apply. This now will apply all of your settings to the panels you have chosen.